This program is primarily about the uh, Civil War in Missouri and St. Louis, and it takes a look at the, uh, the other side, the losing side, uh, uh, the Confederate side. <clears throat> Missouri, of course, was uh, almost ne evenly divided between uh, uh, those who fought for the North and those who fought for the South, and uh, really Missouri was the only state that did that. And so this is a uh, look at the, uh, uh, the story of the, con uh, the Civil War in St. Louis and Missouri from the Confederate point of view. So what I want you to know is that we are in St. Louis. It's 1878, 1878. So the Civil War has been over for 13 years. I'm not a ghost who's come back from the past to visit you. You have come back to the past to visit me. We're all standing on a hillside overlooking Gratiot Street Prison. Now every time I say to you Gratiot Street Prison, I want you to think of a medieval fortress. I want you to think of possibly the worst place you could ever be. It's got a round tower in the center, made out of cut stone, so it's white. It's about four stories tall. On either side of it, there are red brick wings that are three stories tall. So this is a huge building. This is a big structure. And it was turned into a prison during the Civil War. And we'll turn, we'll find out about why it was built and what happened there as the story goes on. So this is not a very complex code. This is not something that you couldn't figure out. I mean, if you had time, if somebody had time, they could go through all 52 combinations and figure it out. So this is, a, uh, this is, you know, just a simple code to give you an idea. You know, part of this program, especially when I, I talk to with adults, I tell them, this program is not meant to upset anybody. But if what I said and some of the things I talked about weren't upsetting to you, I didn't do a good job because this is an upsetting story. So I can tell you anything, but if I don't make you feel something, you're not going to remember it. You're not going to remember it. So hopefully... During the story, you felt a little something.